One question I'm frequently asked is, can red cherry shrimp live with guppies? This feels like a classic combination, but will it work for everyone? In this video, I'm going to answer the question. Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Richard, and I'm the owner of the fishkeepinganswers.com website, where I have almost 300 articles about keeping freshwater fish, shrimp and plants. In my experience, red cherry shrimp and guppies go together really well, providing ample hiding places are provided for the red cherry shrimp. Whilst guppies are not hardcore predators, a large female guppy can easily mow down all but the biggest of red cherry shrimp. Most adult guppies can easily eat baby shrimp. Without sufficient hiding places, your guppies will chip away at the red cherry shrimp population until you have no shrimp left. For this combination to work, live aquatic plants are the answer. In every aquarium where I keep red cherry shrimp with guppies, I tend to pack the tank out with live plants. Your tank does not need to be a professional aquascape, but rather should have a few bunches of plants like Cabomba, Water Wisteria or Pogostemon erectus. Another favourite of mine is Java Moss. These plants all provide an almost infinite number of places for the red cherry shrimp to hide from the hungry guppies. In the description below I've added links for some of my favourite plants to grow in a red cherry shrimp and guppy tank. The main concern people always have is won't the guppies eat the baby red cherry shrimp? And the answer is yes, they will eat some, but how many they eat will depend on how you set up the tank. To be fair, guppies will even eat their own babies if there are not sufficient hiding places. So why does this combination work so well? Both guppies and red cherry shrimp essentially want the same water parameters. Both species like the water temperature to be somewhere between 76 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 24.5 to 26.5 Celsius, and they're both happy living in water with a pH anywhere between 7 and 8, although they can both survive either side of these numbers. Both guppies and red cherry shrimp like the water hard, so if you have plenty of dissolved minerals in your tap water, so much the better. Typically, both guppies and red cherry shrimp are incredibly hardy, so if you're not as hot on your routine aquarium maintenance as you probably should be, both these species will forgive you. There are many benefits to adding red cherry shrimp to an existing guppy tank. Firstly, the red cherry shrimp make an efficient cleanup crew. They will happily deal with any leftover food the guppies do not eat, and they will even break down the guppy poop, making it easier for the filter to deal with. Secondly, red cherry shrimp add an additional layer of colour and interest to your aquarium. The bright red colour of the shrimp really pops in any aquarium they are kept in. Plus the colour of the shrimp can be used to both complement and contrast the colour of the guppies depending what strain of guppies you have. Another benefit to keeping red cherry shrimp with your guppies is the red cherry shrimp really help keep the algae at bay. They won't solve the problem totally and they certainly won't clear up a tank which is overrun with algae but as a preventative measure to keep your guppy tank free of algae red cherry shrimp could be the answer. Do bear in mind Whilst red cherry shrimp are often sold as cleanup crew, they are not just scavengers. They too need to be fed. So consider purchasing some sinking food, such as rapashi gel or algae wafers, for the shrimp. Now, if you're finding this information helpful, please give that like button a quick tap. Liking a video helps support the channel and share this video with other like-minded people. If you're currently breeding guppies to sell or trade in at your local fish store, Adding a colony of red cherry shrimp to breed in the same tank can really boost your earnings. In my experience, with sufficient hiding places, a 20 gallon guppy breeding tank can produce hundreds of red cherry shrimp to sell or trade in for store credit each month. Now, if you already have a guppy tank and you're thinking of adding some red cherry shrimp, do give some consideration to how you will actually add the shrimp to the tank. If you just drop the red cherry shrimp into a tank full of guppies, the guppies will naturally think you have poured in a bag of live food for them. Instead, consider placing the shrimp in a net and then lowering them to the bottom of the tank, ideally where there is a pile of rocks or a bunch of plants. This will give the shrimp a chance to work out where the safe places are before they're eaten. Another way you can add red cherry shrimp to an existing tank is to pour the shrimp down a piece of plastic pipe that is sitting in the aquarium. This will allow the shrimp to bypass all the guppies and get straight to the bottom of the tank. So in answer to the question, and based on my 30 years of fish keeping experience, red cherry shrimp can live in harmony with guppies, providing the aquarium is set up correctly. Another question I'm frequently asked is what are the best freshwater shrimp for beginners? And I answered that question in the video linked on screen. Thanks for watching.